big plan. Right now, the state of Washington is being fined $100,000 a day until it improves school funding. So we'll keep following this story as it develops. Tonight, Portland State is mourning the death of a freshman linebacker from Canby. The school said 20-year-old A.J. Schlatter died after his father says he had throat surgery on Friday. Lisa Balick, live on the PSU campus. What a sad story, Lisa. His teammates tell me it's no surprise. A.J. was always smiling, upbeat, and they say again, no surprise that this walk-on from Canby earned a full scholarship from his work out here on the field. We lost today. Uh, we lost the biggest game we played of the program. But Portland State Vikings football head coach uh, Bruce Barnum tells me A.J. Schlatter was a gem as a player and a role model. A walk-on whose hard work and passion earned him a full scholarship this past season. He is what I wanted to, my football program to be. How he represented himself, his family, Portland State on and off the football field. Uh, he wasn't a Hollywood kid. He just worked. Uh, he did it right. He celebrated with his people. Um, you know, not by himself. AJ's the son of Jim Schlatter, the assistant football coach at Canby High, where AJ played ball. Touchdown, Canby. It was AJ Schlatter who was wide open running across the formation. According to his dad's Facebook page today, AJ was at home last night with his family when suddenly his dad had to give him CPR, but he was unable to be revived. Jim Schlatter wrote he thought his son may have died from a blood clot following tonsil surgery on Friday. I found some of AJ's Viking teammates today who admire him greatly, including his roommate from freshman year. And he was a walk-on. I was on scholarship, so I was kind of like nervous to really get in touch with him. But once when you know I roomed with him for a month, it was like he wanted me to be there. When he got the start against Washington State, his red shirt freshman walk-on, and uh, seeing him, I think he had like eight tackles that game, and that was just uh, a really cool moment for all of us to see. He wanted it. Yeah, he wanted it. He managed to accomplish one of his primary goals of earning a scholarship here on the Portland State football team, and I'm sure his parents were very proud of that. Now, both of AJ's parents had been coaches here. His mother had gone here. His sister had gone here, making this just such a heartache for everyone, both his family at home as well as his PSU family here. Live at Portland State University, Lisa Balick, Coin6 News. Yeah, and your heart and prayers just go out to the family and everyone at PSU mm -hmm. and his teammates.